Hi guys, my name is Gerard James Girl and welcome back to The Sims Mobile. Check out Leo's swanky new outfit. I went over to Izzy and they created this pink suit, which I'm a little bit in love with, although I'm not a fan of the cloud above his head. But anyway, in the last episode, if you didn't see, you should really go and watch that before you watch this one, really. But we retired Kendall. She's still mulling about the house because we haven't moved her out yet, which is something I haven't done with a sim before. I've just left her and I'm happy that she stays up on the picture as well, which is pretty cool. But in today's episode, we're going to switch things up quite a lot with our sims. I kind of... Tommy is not Tommy, Tommy's the kid. Leo is ready to retire along with Kendall. So we're gonna retire him and we're gonna age up Tommy. You can see I've been having a little bit of a decoration. Oh, this guy, by the way, I am in love. Look at this, oh, he's inside. That This one at the front needs to go away. But look at this cool outfit. It's like the mask. I found him when I was at somebody's party and I was like, oh, I need to make friends with this guy. Let's give him a sticker actually. He is so cool. If that's your sim, I love it. It's amazing. We should start a friendship. Or maybe, no, because we're leaving. Leo is going, so there's no point in starting a friendship. Let's retire him now, actually. Let's, so to retire, what do we do? We go in. I can't remember. Oh, the last one. Retire him. When Leo retires, we gain an heirloom. So let's retire him and see what heirloom we get from him. He's so cool. We haven't really seen, like, I know you haven't really seen Leo at all, really, in the game, because I, it was when I was not able to record, but I like Leo. He's pretty cool. Let's see what heirloom we got from him. Hopefully not. Oh, I feel like we have that one already. Maybe? Hopper's outgoing charm. Or maybe not. Maybe I've seen it in the store, actually. Unlocks the outgoing trait. No, I'm pretty sure. Let's add it to the collection. No, we didn't already have it. Cool, so we have like four different ones at the moment. That's excellent. Your legacy will live on. Your long lost cousin has arrived to inherit the household. Okay, I didn't know this was a thing. Long lost cousin has arrived. Awesome. Okay, we will, uh, I mean, I quite like the look of her. Should we go with her or should we customize her? I quite like her, to be honest. Just like that. That's Leo's cousin. What's her name? Oh, she hasn't got a name. Let's give her... Should we... What about Lexi? I just saw Lexi up there. Leo and Lexi. Lexi and... What are the names that have been going... Do you know what? Let's go back to Dust. Because I want to sort of continue the, the fairy Dust. Our original sim. Lexi Dust doesn't sound very good though, does it? <laughs> fairy Dust sounds much better than Lexi Dust. But, never mind, we'll go with Lexi Dust. Yeah, I'm gonna leave her how she is. I'm a fan. But hang on, then they've left the kid in the house? This, okay, um, like the cousin can't get married to the cousin's kid. <laughs> this is just messed up, right? Create sim. Let's just, okay. We have a sim. Can we make, last time, I didn't have, I just didn't have to do this and we could turn him into a, I mean, maybe they just, hmm, okay, right. Let's create a second sim for Lexi. Let's create Lexi's, Lexi's boyfriend and Create a new sim for 25 sim tickets. Yes, please. And um, we want to, we're going to customise this guy. Here's our new guy. This is Asher Daly. Let's add him into the town as well. So he is going to be, so I, I'm a bit confused. We have Lexi Dust. They, Lexi and, uh, what's his name? <laughs> Asher terrible with names are gonna be uh, like boyfriend girlfriend Lexi is Leo's cousin but I thought that I would be able to keep the kid and like I could continue like Tommy's life but Tommy seems to have gone maybe I'm not entirely sure oh we need to choose traits I feel like I mean I feel like generous and ambitious is always like a good one to get because it depends what I'm gonna 
I don't think I've done the medical career, have I? So maybe I should choose... Maybe Lexi can do their medical career and she can be a genius a little bit better at the medical career. Let's do that. Yeah, she can be a bit better at the medical career. And Asher, I feel like he can... Maybe he can go to all the parties. Get bonus party XP. Let's make him the party animal. Do something we haven't done before. So, this kid is still around. Like, I don't really know. I don't really know what's going to happen. It, will he just... Hmm. I don't know. We'll just wait and see what happens. Oh, the mask guy's come in. Excellent. We'll just wait and see what happens with him because... So, they're, they're not actually moved out, as it were, are they? They're still here. Uh, Tommy... If we click on Tommy, not Tommy, Leo, are they, it doesn't say like they're cousins, it says they're strangers, I just wondered whether it would like, I don't know, recognise the, the family link there. Hmm, we'll see what happens, but I do want to make friends with Mask Guy over here. Let's make a friendly introduction with... Oh, can't be talking to someone. Well, oh no, that's that's him. What's his name? Oh, what was that? I didn't see what that said then. Let's start an event with him. They can be friends, and so maybe we should go over. Let's see, actually, if we can get. I feel like my whole family is just. I mean, I know they kind of have. My whole family has just kind of disappeared, and I've just got brand new Sims, and I'm playing a different game, and it's crazy. Let's get Lexi a job. Where is medical? Is it downtown? I think it's downtown. And um, have I unlocked it? No, we don't want that one. Maybe I have. Is it? Maybe it's not here. Hang on. Maybe it's down uh, Market Square. Oh, is this the hospital? Unlock medical center. Whoa, 4,615 to unlock. I've got 4,350. Let me see if I can collect some money from... I don't think I'm going to be able to collect enough money to be able to unlock. Wow, that's it. so expensive. Money is a real issue for me in this game. So, no, she hasn't got quite enough. Or we haven't got quite enough to unlock the medical centre. And I definitely want her to do... The medical career so maybe what hobby can she have what hobbies have we got to do oh yeah because ah <gasps> no oh my goodness i thought i'd completed this one with leo he was so why didn't it finish oh my goodness Okay, so we've only completed the yoga one. I was keeping him, I was keeping Leo, so that he could complete the guitarist hobby. Aye, 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 right, never mind. Let's just, let's go home. This is going wrong. We'll go home, and I have actually got this thing here that I think is the writer's, yeah, an aspiring writer. Let's choose that for... Um... Lexi. Everyone says I'm a great storyteller, so I thought I'd finally learn to write. Yeah, okay. She can she can be that. Why? Requires at least one dining chair. Okay, so we need to have a chair at it. There we go. And yeah, there we go. She can start an event. Perfect. So I do want to add in a third sim. I know I've been talking about it for a while. But I don't know. Why is this not working for me? No idea. Um, yeah, I've been talking about adding in a third sim for a while. And I think... The thing is that kind of confuses me, I think, is the way how they're all... I know that the whole thing is, like, the whole thing of Sims Mobile is, like, the legacy and passing down things from your family. Like, um, the heirlooms and traits and different things. But now I'm a little bit confused. Just so in my house, right? So I've got. Although, if they can have, if they have a child, I can make that 
child and adult living in the house, right? Is that a thing? Maybe that's a thing that I will maybe try rather than like actually adding a new sim that they have a baby and their baby becomes the third sim. Does that work? We'll have to see. I think that is the better option rather than like adding in another adult. Adding in another adult doesn't really make any sense to me in terms of the story. Like, uh, although none of the story makes sense to me that we've still got a kid knocking around. That <laughs> oh, I don't know. Maybe I'm thinking too much about it and like <laughs> reading too much into it all. It doesn't really matter, I suppose. We've completed a quest. Let's click that. Can we? Because they're not playable. I was going to say, well, can we bring him back actually? We could bring. How do we go into? Click on the picture, I think. Oh no, we can only move them out. I was going to say, can we? Can we bring him back so that we can? Or maybe we could bring him back if we had a spot. Like if I unlocked a playable sim, maybe we can bring one of those back. Is that a thing? Maybe I should try. Maybe I should try that because I would like to try and complete. Oh, I've got a new quest. I would like to try and complete. I don't know what it was. A the guitar hobby with him, and I'm really annoyed that that didn't finish because that was <laughs> what I was trying to do. To be honest, oh, he's finished a friendship event. I want them to be like best friends. Which ones haven't we done? I don't know which. Um. Oh, it's, I was going to say it doesn't say, but it does say. We've done the BFFs forever, and we've done two peas in a pod. I want, like, a cool... He's not He's not a geek, is he? I feel like art aficionados. Maybe goes well with this guy. Mm, yeah, I like that story. They will become art aficionados together. Sounds like a plan to me. Let's just start a little event with him. I always do short events. Do you guys? Like, I can always access my game because I obviously work from home. And I'm always able to get on my game. And so the short events are the best ones to be doing. And I tend to... Like, I can get on my game at least once every hour to... You know, to complete the event and start a new one. And so I'm always doing the short events rather than... The longer ones definitely make sense in terms of the prizes that you win, like the XP and the hobby points or relationship points or whatever that you get. Right, I am going to unlock a third sim, I think. Right, let's see. So let's click on this and unlock a playable sim for 175 Sim cash, which to be honest, I don't think is too bad. When the first game first came out, we were, I think everyone was like, whoa, 175. But actually, I feel like you do get a lot of sim cash within the game. You can unlock it or win it with various different things. So I don't think it's too bad, 175. Let's go ahead and unlock that now. And can we... Now, let's see. So we can add a sim... We can create a new playable sim there for 35 sim tickets. But does it mean that we can also bring back an old sim? No, it doesn't. Once they're retired, they're retired. It's tough. Okay, that's good to know. <laughs> but we have promote. What does promote mean? We don't have any sims that are ready to be played. So I think we just have to wait. I think we will be able to play Tommy. And once he's old enough, I think that I haven't left him to age up enough. Maybe like tomorrow, like in real time, tomorrow he will be ready to age up. He hasn't even got a toddler bed. <laughs> I really need to start this house. Maybe tomorrow he will age up and then, yeah, we'll make him into our playable sim that he can be another adult living in the house. That makes sense to me. I don't mind that story because I don't kind of want to lose Fairy. And Fairy Dust was like the original sim and I want to keep her legacy. Although I suppose, uh, what's her name? Lexi. If she's Leo's... Oh no, because Leo's 
long lost cousin. Leo wasn't part, he married into the family. I'm getting confused by. Yeah, so Dust was like the original, and, Owen, and she married Owen, and then they had their baby was Kendall, and Kendall married Leo. So, yeah, yeah, so Leo, Leo's cousin isn't in, in any way related, like he is, but they're related through marriage, but Leo's cousin, Lexi, isn't blood related to fairy dust. Oh, family's complicated. Right. <laughs> okay, let's let's continue. Have we got some stickers to give out or anything? Yeah, we still haven't given out all our stickers today. We should... Hang on, who's this? Let's give her a sticker. She looks cute. Uh, cute isn't a thing, but let's say she looks hot then. She looks hot. I like giving out stickers to people. Does everybody use their stickers? I didn't used to use them, but now when I go to a bank, I make sure that I go to two parties every day. And when I'm at parties, I like to hand out all my stickers for everyone. I think it's a nice thing to do. We should probably put on... Right, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. I think I'm getting more questions than answers about this game, to be honest. I'm sure probably lots of you understand it more than me at the moment, but I'm getting there. Um, yeah, I'm getting there. We should actually, we should place before we go. Hang on. Let's place. We have bodies. We haven't got any space actually to... I just want to put them down and see what they look like. And, and we have hoppers. We need like a cabinet. There must be like a cabinet where we can place all of these, right? They're pretty cool. I'm going to take up like a whole wall in the house. Right, anyway, I'm going to end it here. So next episode, hopefully Tommy will be able to age up. And it, maybe we could actually build like two houses on the lot. Maybe that, I mean, I know we're stuck for rooms at the moment, which is something that's really quite annoying how many rooms we can have. But potentially I could have two rooms on the lot, two um, houses on the lot. Tommy could live in one with his girlfriend when he gets one, like he's only a toddler at the moment. So he could live in one with his girlfriend or boyfriend or whatever. And Lexi and... What's this guy's name? <laughs> Lexi and... Why Asher? Why are I have such a bad memory for names? Lexi and Asher could live in a different one. Maybe that could be a thing. Two houses on one lot. Hmm, maybe. Right, let me know what you think about that idea. But thank you so much for watching. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you are new. Don't forget to hit the bell so that you're notified. I can't speak. Hit the bell to be notified whenever I upload a new video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys soon. Bye.